Yo, are we ready? Yep. Ignore my fat. <laughs> Mine too. What, I'm Jumbo? I'm tired. Genesis, I'm Jess. And this is? Let's see how this goes. Woohoo! We're so enthused. Yeah, hold your applause, please. Wait till the end. Because <laughs> we're going to knock your socks off. <laughs> um, probably not. <laughs> so this will be like a two-part series. Yeah. So we've done How Well Do We Know Each Other, which pretty well, we're married. But this one I thought, like, it's going to sound mean when I say, like, how well do we pay attention? Because... I'm gonna quiz my husband, Genesis. Mm -hmm. I have ten questions about like our day to day life. Yep. So it's not like what city I was born in, what's my favorite color? Like not stuff like that. It's just basic stuff. You'll see in the, you'll you'll get it when mm -hmm. I start asking the questions. It was hard to explain to him. <laughs> Wait so, on me. So next week he'll be quizzing me on how well do I pay attention to him and his stuffs. Yeah. Yeah, he's so enthused. Let's do this. He also looks so handsome. Oh, I decided to wear blue with more blue. We ready? What you got? Okay. This might be hard for you and you can't look, but what book am I currently reading? Uh, not a clue. It's, uh... I know your series you're reading, I believe, is something that your family or like most of your family has read yeah could you give me any <laughs> could you not necessarily could you give me any do you, i've talked to you about about them uh they're this is not they're not cave people but they're like the people before humans i can't think of like not like neanderthals is one of them neanderthals are involved yep yeah, the, i think they're crow magnets is uh, what they're called okay um I remember early, you tell me. Early humans. I remember you tell me the end of one book. The female lead character had to leave her son for, in her tribe as out. She was exiled and from her clan. Yes. Uh, that's the last thing I believe I remember you tell me about because that was the end of the first book. And I don't know how many books there are in the series, but. Well, if I just told you about the first book, <laughs> I'm on the second book. There you go. Well, you got that one. It's nailed it. The Clan of the Cave Bear series. I'm on book two. Cave Bear. Okay. The Valley of Horses. I was gonna throw something out there with bears, but in with no context, I've just been like bears, and there's probably no bears at all. <laughs> I show my picture book with bears on it. This is the book I'm currently reading. <laughs> it's a real <coughs> page starter. But you do remember the premise somewhat. I'll give you a half a point. Because you weren't yeah. totally oblivious. You weren't like, you're reading a book? <laughs> like, is it a Dr. Seuss book? Uh, I can read Goosebumps. About what time do I take care of the pets each day? 10.30 at night. It's after you take your pill. It's either before or after you take your pill, but it's 10.30 is when you start doing things. It's between 10 and 11, yeah. Okay. So it's right on the bat. Yeah, I, t I do the night shift, he does the morning shift. So you get one full point. So, we know you know this one. What time do I take my meds? 10.30. Yeah, well, I try my best. Another point. Woo, he knows when I need to be medicated. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is a big, a big one. Oh, geez. What are the first five things I do when I get home from work? Uh, I'm saying bathroom is one of them. Yep, I pee. I pee hard. You eat. No. I would assume you'd eat. I do after I do all these five things. Oh. Uh, you check on the animals. Yep. All of the creature, creatures. Creatures. Oh, you get the mail. Yep. I you guess get. one pertains to, it depends on the season. So that water and plants. Yeah. Is one of them? Yep. Okay, water and plants. It's not like check the receipts, is it? It's computer stuff. Is where I um, just like check my emails, like check our bank account, check my work website, check YouTube. The youbs. The youbs. Yeah, yep. those are the five things I do like right away when I get home. Nailed it. Yeah. See, you knew it better than you thought. I, yeah. I'm a creature of habit. Mm. <laughs> I, give you, I give you a full point. I did it. 
Another big one. Okay, what are the four things I make sure to do on Sundays? Why would you hurt me this way? <laughs> it's Sunday now. Uh, you read a Bible verse. You water all the plants? Yes. The indoor plants. Do you want a hint? Yep. The last two involve phones. I know you charge your work phone, but I thought you did that every day. No. Okay. It's only Sundays? Yep, I gotta make sure my work phone is charged for the week. Set your alarms for the week. Yep, because <laughs> my work schedule changes. There you go. Here we go. I set my alarms, water the plants, read a page Bye. of the Bible or whatever, and um, charge my work phone. Yep. I do other things, but those are like, I have to do them someday or I'll die. <laughs> Well, the, uh, I'd say setting your alarms is pretty important. Yeah. So you get one full point. This one's easy. How many calories do I eat in a day when it's not a cheat day? Oh, uh, it used to be 2,000, but is it down to 1,800? No. <laughs> Never was. Oh, so it's still 2,000? Yeah. Okay. One whole point. Or no, you uh, didn't change your calories. You're trying to up your protein. Yeah. I was down to 1900 the week, the month before the wedding. It didn't do squats, so I'm like 2000 again. I need an extra 100 to get through <laughs> it's the understandable. day. understandable. Okay, what album am I currently obsessed with? It's Hailstorm's new album. It's a new Hailstorm CD, Back from the Dead. It's the moon. Oh, it'll be a half a point. I'm saying, who knew she died? No. <laughs> what? Can't be Back from the Dead if you didn't die. So, what quote-unquote show am I into right now? Because I watch YouTube. Um, whoever breaks down, like, so-and-so, uh, this this week is Trixie, or this season is Trixie breaking down uh, RuPaul's, I don't know if it's All-Stars or the regular season. It's all of the above. It's the pit stop. The pit stop. There we go. Right now I'm watching the Canadian season of Pit Stop. I don't have the capability to watch actual Drag Race, so this is the closest I get. Two more. I thought this one was a curveball. Um, what shoes did I wear every single day this past week? If it's a hint, I can't wear anything when my toesies are showing for work. I. It's not like I know your shoes. I've, I'm going <laughs> to take a big old zero on this one. This is my black flats from Walmart. Okay. It's hot. I can't have my feet, my toes showing. So just, my feet. My feet. So zero. And then, very easy. The final question: What do I eat for breakfast? Uh, non cheat days. Um, cheat days. It's whatever goes into my mouth. Uh, granola bar, or breakfast bar, I guess. And. Uh, your caffeine for the day. Your tea usually or my caffeine for the day and what type of bar? It's um, it's a protein bar. Yeah. Oh, okay. you didn't say protein. Oh, okay. I had said granola, which is incorrect. Is a protein bar? Protein bars are more expensive. We learned, but yeah, I eat a protein bar and my caffeine. It varies per week. So my add up your score. What was it? Seven and a half or eight and a half? Wait. What? It's eight. Shush! I'm counting. You got eight. Eight out of ten. I say that's pretty good. I'm kind of surprised. That was a B minus. I'll take it for a husband. <laughs> I'm glad you settled. <laughs> but I thought that was interesting to see how, like, I didn't need him to know <laughs> these things. But just to see if he picks up on what I, just me just going about my business. Definitely don't pick up on your shoes. <laughs> good man. Thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> I wanted it here. <laughs> we'll see you next week for if I know Genesis's stuff as well as he knows mine. What I have it? a vague idea of what my shoes look like. I could totally answer the question of what shoes you wore this week. <laughs> well, bye-bye. We'll, we'll see you next week.